Life Through the Eyes of Local Teens, a new exhibit at the Minneapolis Institute of Art, showcases the creative talents of dozens of students in the metro. Their focus, the work of addressing racism through art. At the Minneapolis Institute of Art, a big unveiling. The colorful drawings and posters adorning the walls are all works of art created by this group of local teens. It feels really great having something put up in a museum that where everyone can come here and look at it and admire it. Representing students from North High School, Como Park High, and Minnesota Transitions Charter School, the new exhibit focuses on racism as a public health crisis. In partnership with the MIA and Blue Cross and Blue Shield of Minnesota, the young creatives were mentored by professional artists and through art, some found an outlet. It's good. It feels good. Anthony McArthur collaborated with two other students on this piece, based in part, he says, on his own life experiences. When police see me on the street, what you think they expect? What you think they assume? First thing they say to me, you got anything on you? Anything illegal? You got a weapon on you? That's the first thing they say to me when they see me, like, what? That's not, that's not how you greet somebody. Addressing racism, social injustice, and racial inequity, the visuals are an expression of anger, hurt, hope, and healing. They are taking it in. They are observing. They are analyzing it, processing it. And I think what you see in the artwork is exactly that. It's nice to know that like our generation cares and that some people know that they have a voice and that they can like share their story in different ways. It's something that I made in the, on the wall in the museum for other people to see. They gonna see and they gonna, they gonna get the idea, like it's real. This is not a game, it's not, this stuff happening for real. The exhibit will be displayed in the Community Commons Gallery at the MIA from now until February 6th.